So people people represent their allegiance to Trump in terms of certain you know putative tangible benefits that he represents. But the the real uh, wellspring of their attraction to him, their allegiance to him, is uh, uh, it, it is his symbol for a certain kind of hero system or a certain range of uh, hero systems, which are less uh, less compromised by what exper- conservatives experience to be these very uh, you know unnatural, artificial uh, demands imposed by liberalism. So one way of judging hero systems is do they enable you to be more effective and pass on your genes in life? And so I'm thinking about one woman I know who was a volunteer for the Hillary Clinton campaign. And when Hillary lost in November of 2016, she could not go to work for six weeks. She was basically, she took to bed for about six weeks so that would strike me as probably a maladaptive hero system. And as, as opposed to, say, someone who was volunteering for Hillary, supporting Hillary, was devastated when Hillary lost, but then, you know, went out and started marching in pussy hats and made, like, valuable friends and contacts and enhanced the quality of her life by, by taking action. 